Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god, I Trouble's was on coming. The path. There we go. All right, all right. It's all good. We bought the new front end loader. It's a lot better than the other front end loader. Oh, buddy. Like I was picking up five logs, and it was like every 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 load was five logs. And it's a lot easier to get those five logs. Although it's, I like it's. I think it's part of that's because of the better. I I think the um forks. We bought both types of forks, so you can see figure out which one you like more. <laughs> wow, we like rolling in the dough now. We're we're, we're saving up five hundred sixty-five thousand so we could buy a better combine. Oh, bad leg spike! Whoa, fuck off, computer! Bad Whoa. leg spike. Uh, is Stop. it? Are you transporting? And right that was the worst timing for synchronizing. <laughs> I'm on the truck here, T Tex. Okay. Oh. Yeah, we just lost one of the forks. They fell off. Perfect. Okay, hang on, hang on. Oh, great. We can fix this. Oh, um. Hmm. Oops. Hang on. Should I go, like, pick it up or something, or...? Eh. Just put that there. Okay. Uh, yeah, go... Well, actually... Yeah, start it up. Yeah, you can get off there first. I'm gonna change something here. Part of this problem is this fucking thing is too long. Oh, shit. This is a beast. So maybe I can dump this fork onto there. Yeah, because what you're going to do... Yeah. Put the fork you have right here where I'm standing. Okay. Does it matter the orientation, or is this fine? As long as you can get at it when... Well, it's going to sit sideways if you put it there. Okay. straighten up. Yeah, that'll be fine. Put that there. Now go get the others. And you know what? Fuck it. We're close. You can drive <laughs> along okay. with me to get there. Sounds good. Oh, come on! What's with these lag spikes all of a sudden? My internet was fine! What are you guys doing over there? <sighs> Trying to pick up this fork. This is kind of weird, it's on a bit of an angle. Oh, you gotta approach it from this side. Is it that side? Oh, okay. Cause that's how it, yeah, because that's how it orients. Oh. Shit. Well, not anymore. Uh, <laughs> God damn it! It's stuck on the wheel. Okay. 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 Now, okay. Now you gotta approach. Now you gotta approach it from this side. Fuck! This camera is just. You uh, having some difficulty with that thing? A little bit. Um. Lift your uh, loader up a bit. Oh, yeah, I got and it. then angle that down. There we there go. 
This thing's got some big claws on it. Well, it's a heavy motor. Anyways, just follow me. So I think, I guess this one's better for picking claw mode, like claw style. Uh, that one's like brute, for you, that particular fork you can pick up a huge amount of stuff. Yeah, that's why I like it, you just kind of ram it in there. Excellent. You, it works a lot better when there's more logs, like if there's only three logs you can't really Brute force, because I'll just push. I'll just push them. But if there's like a tractor or something holding them all in, you can just ram them all in and it works great. Do we only have one loader here? Ryan, go get the other loader. Oh, well, okay. The trees aren't, the, I was going to say, the trees aren't ready yet. Oh, okay. Because oh. the, the front end loader isn't going to have a job until the trees are grown anyway. So I just got to move. I moved it in the Scorpion King up here. Where, where are the trees? Yeah. These things over here? Yeah. yeah, these are the trees that have been planted. They're growing. There's a lot of trees. Does that mean I don't need the... I mean, does that mean you don't need this tractor? Well, I guess not. Are we going to... Beautiful. Are we keeping the other yeah, loader, just... or...? Uh, the other loader was kind of crud. Yeah, it was shit. Compared so to this much one, better. so yeah. Do you want this loader for now? I don't know. There's three of you. Well, we don't have any trees to cut right now, anyway. Okay, you don't have to. You don't have to convince me too hard. Are you gonna repurpose it for uh, farming? Already am. I think all we have, all, all we really need is two loaders, and then we're good, right? Or what? You know, two things loading. I mean, yeah, two things for loading is fine. We'll worry about that once the trees are grown up, because we're gonna have a few crops to pull in the meantime. What are you, what are you doing, Ryan? So, since there's no trees, what should we do? Well, I'm heading back down to the farm. You can give me a hand. I'm kind of overworked at the moment. Let's do it. Wait, man, this thing's got like fucking eight tires now. Eight wheels. Well, that was the other John Deere that was busy planting the trees. Once they finished the job, it came down. I like this one. Okay, so what do you need All help right. with? I need the super tractor to cultivate one more line. Or someone to take this and sell the corn. Uh, I can do that. Okay. Do we know where we're taking it? Uh, the highest price of corn. I don't know where that is. I'll check. This is corn, you said? Yep. Grain mill. Ah, that's close. Oh, oh shit, that's a fucking house. Shed. How'd you find that out, Richard? Hmm? Oh, never mind, I see. How did I what? Oh, like, how'd you find out where where to sell it? Oh, um, c what you do is you you press escape, and you see at the top tabs, go to the one that looks like a bar graph. It shows you selling prices. If you click on the corn on the, let's, if you look at the right, there's like one of the symbols is corn, right? Yep. If you click on that. It'll sort by highest sell price, and then you'll see the grain mill sell is, is the highest selling price, right? 
So, and then you click on the grain mill on the name, and then you tag the place, and it'll tell you. And that way it'll show you on the minimap where to go. Yeah, I mean, you can just read the labels or whatever, but... Why does it say I need to plow already? Has it already been three times? Seriously? No way. I thought it's only been twice. Production's ramping up, man. Fuck. I don't believe that. Okay, what needs to be done? Uh, maybe help him with the lime? Is that it? Or plowing? No, oh, plowing. That's a fucking nightmare. I hate plowing. Okay. You have to do it manually, too. I'll get right to do it. This is what he's here for. Oh, you want to learn how to plow? It's the hardest job of farming. Oh my god. Well, if you know how to plow, then you can do anything else. Farming, anyways. So this is the plow. Unless, unless Ryan, unless you want to drop this grain off, I'm already here. Oh. Where, where is this? Um, I'm just gonna, hold on. I'm just gonna leave this, do you want to drop stuff or do you want to plow? Well, I'm gonna drop it off. Okay, I'm gonna leave the truck here. Uh, it's right next to the grain mill, you just need to turn it around. So I'm gonna get out. Come over here and come, come to this truck. AFK a few minutes. Wait, what? Truck in the truck. Okay, so you're in the there, truck. There, there, there. So you see this this green drop off little? It's like a grill, a grate or something. You need to drive it on top of this thing, and then once it's positioned like, over top, what? Like back it in? No, no. You can just drive over it. It's got. It's just a grate on top of a platform. Uh, you just drive over top of it. And then once the trailer is positioned over top, there will be a pr uh, prompt to unload it. Yeah, it's really simple. Just drive on top. Just keep drive straight. Yeah, there you drive straight. Just keep going, keep going. You, you gotta, the trailer has to be over, right? In the trailer. Got it? Okay. And yeah, just press I. And just wait for it to unload all of it. And then just drive it back? Uh, once it's finished unloading, you can see in the top right, it's, a, it's giving our money now. Once it's finished, you can drive it back. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So what's this plowing now? This plowing business? Uh, it's a bitch, because the tool itself is... The harvester is going to need to get unloaded. It's like ASAP. But if you'd like, I can show you how to plow. Sure. Is it even harder to do it at night? Yes, it is harder to do it at night. Shit. What happens if I crash into one of these cars? Uh, nothing. You break it, you buy okay. it. So, uh, what makes plowing hard is, especially with this plow, like a little plow, it's not hard, it's very easy, but the bigger, the, the big ass fucking plows like this one, mm -hmm. It's uh, because it's so long. It's really unwieldy when you get to the end of the front. When you get to the end of the line and you got to turn around, it's really annoying. Uh, see the orientation of the plow. See how it's like going off to the right. Yeah. Well, when I turn around, uh, it's going to be hard to line it up again. So the plow has a has a rotation feature. So as soon as you get to the end of the line here, and the entire plow is no longer plowing. Because you're like on the road, right? Yeah. Like the back part of the plow is off the field. Uh, you wait for that, and then you lift it up. A second here. Okay, you lift it up, and you turn, and you rotate the plow around. All while it's fucking turning around, it's kind of a bitch. Oh, Jesus. You know, it's, it's like ro it's spinning around on behind. Yeah. <laughs> It's hard because that was really that was, it's like hilly here. Oh my god, no! Stuck. Yeah. Oh, there it goes. I had to just. Oh wait. Almost. Nah. And then you lower it and you go again. So I'm lining the the wheel up. 
the closest part of the plow. I'm lining it up with what I just plowed. Oh, okay. And that's it. That's it. Like, it's not like super fucking hard. It's just really annoying. All the other tools that you use to farm, you just drag them behind you. And I usually just hire uh, an AI to do it. But um, AI or this, it's like that procedure, what I just did is too complicated for them and they're fucking. So that plowing has to be done manually. It's annoying. Damn. Does it, it doesn't matter if you overlap a little bit. No. You want? I'd rather overlap a lot, a little, than leave a gap. Okay. Okay. Yeah, and that be. Uh, can you? The harvester's full. Can you move him to a place where uh, he can be emptied? Uh, you mean the combine? Yeah. Farming's like boring. Well, not not boring. It's relaxing, but when you're harvesting and plowing and doing all this shit by yourself, it's kind of a bitch. <laughs> oh, I see. You're plowing the same field that he's harvesting. Ryan, where are you? Yeah. Bring the truck over. Mm, trying. I guess I got lost. You got lost. You're at the... Okay, I can see you. Just don't run over the crops. If you want, you can drive the harvester and he can, like, without an AI. Uh, sure. I mean, I'm, I'm going wide here, Ryan. <laughs> Real wide. Uh, Ryan, get over here. What are you doing? Over which way? Where's the harvester? Behind is. you. To your right. There you go. This is a new combine. No. Okay, just what do I do? Just drive underneath this little thing here. Will it do it automatically, or do I need to? Yeah, no, it'll. It, you just bring out the arm. Ryan, Ryan, you have to get the trailer under it. Uh. There you go. So... Really, you should be doing this as I as I harvest. But it's hard to do it because it only swings out to the left side. So what I'm, yeah. yeah. Corn is hard because it fills the it fills the harvester really. Sunflowers don't fill it nearly as fast. How, how full are you, Ryan? Sixty-five percent. You're not gonna fill him. Okay, that's good. Oh. Shit. oh. Wait. Don't what? don't follow me because I'm gonna have to, I'm going this way right now. Okay, so should, should you, you stay here? You, yeah, you can't drive over the the crops. If you drive over the crops, it'll kill. The, it'll blow it. So just press B to start harvesting. Uh, yep. Yeah. And make sure that it's actually harvesting and not you're just driving into it and killing everything. That's the important part. It'd be a lot easier if it wasn't nighttime, but Jesus, it's hard to get this thing straight. <laughs> Yeah, just uh, just as long as you're not leaving like leaving any behind on the right side, it doesn't. It looks like there was a like a, a one row left here. Yeah, there's a bug with the field. There's a few that won't get picked up. Like you'll drive right over them and they won't get picked up. It's kind of that's weird. Yeah. See, Ryan, when I'm going this way. Technically, you could drive the truck under me, and pit and it'll unload into your into your uh, trailer as I'm doing this. Isn't that difficult? No, nah, it's oh. actually easier than you think. Because you can set on cruise control and literally just coast right next to me. But I mean, right now I'm only about ten percent full, so it's not a huge deal. How many passes do you usually take to get 100% on this line? Uh, I don't know. I don't really count. 
try to unload them every single pass that you're driving with the tube on the... Okay. Oh my god, it needs lime too. Fuck. <laughs> Where'd you go, Richard? Uh, hold on. You're gonna have to wait till I do another pass here. Then when this gets full, you have to take it to the green mill? Uh, yep. yes. Exactly what you just did. The only difference is you have to drive it, drive there this time. And don't drive like a crazy man, because don't, you don't tip over the trailer. Oh my god. Driving on an angle. Uh -huh. Is it is a bigger combine on your, still on your next purchase or what? Yeah. It's actually not going to be bigger than that one, but it's going to have a bigger car. Uh, I mean, that's just more efficient, less, less unloading. Oh boy. Hey, you missed a few spots here, Richard. Nah, it's just a bug. I feel like this is almost like driving a Zamboni, right? <laughs> I've never driven a Zamboni, so... Uh, what I'm saying is it like it kind of looks like it feels the same. Because you're just going slow and you're just going sweeping motions. Okay, here. I'm gonna extend the thing and you can just drive under it. I'm going what? 10. I extended the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, first of all, I'm facing the wrong way. Well, whose fault is that? Wait, 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 wait. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Line yourself up. Oh, uh, you can press two and, two and one to adjust your cruise control up and down. It's the one on the bottom right underneath your speedometer. And Jeez. Uh, so let me line this thing up. Did you see what I just said? Two and one to... Adjust That's all I heard. Oh, fuck sakes. Two and one to adjust this, the cruise control on the bottom right. It's underneath their speedometer. And then press 3 to uh, start or stop the cruise control. I mean, it, it'll go turn off as soon as you take assume manual control. Wait, wait. Am I underneath? Well, your truck is, but not the trailer. I'm trying to line it up. So line it up. Need to pull forward a bit more. How do you what cruise control? What the fuck? What is it at? There we go. go. Yeah, it's not that hard. We're already at the end. How full are you? 90. 98. It'll, it'll stop on me. I'm full. Don't worry. Okay, here we go. I'm full. Okay, so you go drop that off. Man, can these roads get any more... Just be careful, man. ...windy? Yeah.
So it doesn't matter if I hit other vehicles? Well, I mean... Mm, no, just don't tip the trailer over. Yeah, just whatever you do, don't tip the trailer. Or the truck. I mean, don't flip the truck. That's obviously a bad thing, too. Shit, I'm going the wrong way. God damn it. The pro tip is you don't have to follow the road. Yes. Some, uh, you can drive across fields. It doesn't matter if you're driving across fields we don't own. Because, you, whatever, you're not going to crush nothing. But, you know, even fields have a bit of slopes to them, so watch out. It's, but generally it's easier than the roads. It doesn't matter if you hit signs either. Sign, you can just run through signs. It doesn't do anything. Which fields do we own? The red one. Just this one. Well, this one and number one, right? Yeah, the tree one we own. But... It's the it's the one with the red numbers, right? I'm heading back. Probably shouldn't run over these. So how full are you, Richard? Uh, about eighty percent right now. Just get ready, like, once they turn around, right? Yeah, I'm gonna line up on the other side. reach 100% before I reach the end. I got the empty? I might. Hold on. I'm almost there. I think we're good. Okay. You want me to empty it out first? Or? Well, just... Here, you can do it, go under it. I'm, I'm only at 98%, so just... Just, pos yeah, position yourself, there you go. Because it'll empty faster than I can harvest it. 
As long as you stay underneath it. I'm sticking out a little bit, so I'm veering to the right just a little bit. Ah, oh, come on. To me, it feels easier to use a tractor to do that than the truck. There we go. You keep fearing, dude. Yeah, cause like, I'm, dude, I'm, it takes, I'm guessing it takes a little bit of practice. I'm just not straight enough on this thing. I'm at around 70%. Okay, well I'm, I'm only at 12% now. I, I unloaded most of it. 70% you said? Yeah, 80% now. Okay, so. Uh, line yourself up for the next pass. Well, I'm not going to get through the whole pass. No, that's fine, that's fine. Just fill, just fill enough so you can fill the rest of it and then you can go. Uh, when I'm harvesting, I'm actually lining up the furthest into the crop side of the header rather than the outer one. That's how you get a really straight line. Say what? Like the, you mean like the, you can the see, you can see the, you can, yeah, you can see the rows, right? If you look through, there's there in and I don't know how many rows the header can take. I don't really count, but I just I just line it once. Once I've lined up the right side, so that it's mat like completely taking as much as I can, then I just I I I run the the leftmost side. Uh, I line that side up. That's the side that I line up. All right, I think I know what you're talking about, but I need to I need to like this. The edge isn't straight anymore, so I need to like even it out a little bit. Oh my god, what the hell have I done here? Wait, 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 hold on. Careful. This would be a lot easier if it was daytime. Ninety-five percent. Again, it doesn't matter. It'll it'll stop pouring once it reaches hundred. I'm I'm at zero. Okay, now. I'm I'm at hundred percent. That's okay. It's only four. I got distracted. I was spinning my camera a bit. <laughs> I was like, oh, I can see. I can see Travis over there. This seems like the perfect job for an AI, though. AI does that well. They just don't do the plowing well.
So every time we dump a load in here, does that mean the price goes down? Um, no. Technically, yeah, but like the price doesn't move that quickly. It only moves quickly when we're at 120% normal, or 100, 120 times normal speed, which is what I'm doing when we're when it's growing. Uh, like we're not in that right now. We're only at, we're in, we're in real time. So, yeah, by the time like when you start. When you start harvesting the crop, it'll say it's at 2,000. By the time you're done harvesting the crop, it might be at like 1998 or something like that. Like it's dropped a little bit. But as soon as I click it back on 120 times, it'll plummet because we just flooded it. Which oh is why God. we switched to sunflowers. You guys just don't uh, Okay, so. I didn't know you can drive over benches and now I'm stuck on it. <laughs> Fuck's sakes. <laughs> Need a little bit of a tap then. Oh my god. You stuck? Like 100% stuck? Yeah, it's, it's stuck between the the back and the, okay. the actual truck. Come on, let me see if I can get you unstuck. I'll put this on. I'll just set the worker on this for now. Stupid bench. Who, who would put a bench on here anyway? Oh, this thing's full of lime. I'm coming. Just get a better engine for this fucking tracker. This looks like going quick. Uh, the engines don't really make them go fast. They all every tractor we have has an up, has the upgraded engine in it. Uh, it's kind of just most of them. Most tractors go around forty. Some of them go around like sixty, but dude, sixty? God damn. Hmm, I might be able to wiggle this thing out. Well, I'm here already. Okay, well, you can help me out then. You, you have to, like, push it from the other side. The other side? Uh, the, the park bench is, like, on the other side of the... Yeah. Oh, I see. You can reverse it? Can't you straighten yourself out? I'm gonna try pushing you. Hold on. You know what, Ryan? Hold on, hold on. You know what? Uh, why don't you? Why don't you unhitch it? Unhitch it. Back up a bit. Back up a bit and unhit unhitch it. Uh, where's that? Q. And straighten yourself out a little bit. Um, move. Are you stuck? No. Then move out of the way. Move. Like, move out oh. of the way. Hmm. 
my god, dude. What are you doing? I told you to move! I'm I, like, I'm like, so far away already. You just have to like nudge it away from it. It's kind of hard. All um, right, now everybody freeze. Oh, jeez. Thank you for reminding me to save the game. <laughs> Better you don't ask what's going to happen. Oh, in that fine. case, I really want to know. Having some issues. Everything's fine. I'd like to report that the harvester is no longer harvesting because it's full. Yeah, it's full. I'm sitting in it right now. We're working on it. Dumb. Don't be dumb, plow. Oh, you're gonna. I fucking hate this. Nice. Movie. <laughs> Did you in the truck? I know. Okay. It's all yours. What in the world are you two doing? Nothing. You don't need to know. Nothing's happening over here. We're all good. Now I know to steer clear of park benches. I said signs. I said you could drive through signs. I didn't said nothing about park benches. Whoa. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Ryan. What? Madman. Whoa, whoa. Oh, Jesus. Remember not to drive in the crops. This thing's hard to drive. Nah. Combine can't move. Oh, Ryan's here to unload it. Richard, do you want to try a line of plow? Sure. Here, I'll stop, and you can you can finish the current row. Uh, there's still logs in the log trailer. What? The... There was a few left over. Oh just yeah. When the trailer gets moved up. There's just you... money sitting in a trailer. So things go, you know, all you gotta do is go forward until you keep this, keep this tire right here, keep that lined up, see how it's like right on the edge of what's not done. That's how you like maximize efficiency. I see. So just keep, oh. keep, uh, keep that lined up. It's okay if you go over a little bit. Does it, does it matter if I run over this? 
You can run over that. It's just don't run over the, the grown crops. That's yeah. all. You can run over the here, and you can run over where he's plowing. Interfere. No problem there. Interfere a little bit. That's okay. As long as it, it doesn't matter if you're like a little over, it's okay. As long as you're not missing, it, like, you know, there's yeah. gaps. Don't, don't leave gaps. A little overlap is fine, as long as there's no gaps. Um, okay, so what you're going to want to do when you get to the end here is, obviously, like I said, wait until this, at the very end, is done. And then immediately hit V to lift it up. And then turn, but not too sharp, to line up with where you're Why is this one plowing again. It kind of veers a little bit. That's okay, just don't leave gaps. Oh, yeah. That's the... I'll, I'll explain why that is, why it veers like that in a sec. You're good. Okay, so drive straight out. There we go. To let it, like... To let it finish, and then hit V when it's done. Okay. Hit V. Now turn, but not super sharp. And you're going to want to line yourself up, like, right here. Like the track. Wait, is it not... Is it rotating? Not yet. You have to do that, but you don't want to rotate it while you're turning. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh. So keep oh turning in God. towards me. Uh, that should be okay. Now hit... Hit what? B. To turn it. See it turning. Ah. And then... Line it up with this shit, and hit V to lower it back down, and... So the reason why it is like that, why it's cut out like that, is... Um, sometimes when you're starting it, or when I'm starting it, this is still swinging to the left. Because I'm still, it's still coming out of the turn. Oh, I so see. So that, that's why that leaves. See, it's doing it for you, too. It's just the way it is. There. You're plowing. I'm That's, plowing. See why it's annoying? It's just like, this part's easy, what you're doing right now. But like, just the turn is annoying. Because this shit likes to get caught. Like, if you try to turn the plow while you're turning, it fucks everything up and everything goes. Make sure there's no gaps. But yeah, the turning is definitely the hardest part. Okay, I'm gonna get the other plow. Then we have another plow. Uh, not plow. Sorry. Uh, I need to. I need to. We need to line. We have like four Annoying. people working on the field right now. <laughs> it's quite the operation. Yeah, it's gonna be even more crazy when I have more than one. All right, you getting good at uh, aligning there? Whoa! Uh. Cruise control is handy for this. There we go. It's the initial lineup that I can't get hold of. Okay, so that's cool. Fernando does not want to lime. <laughs> what? So I guess I'll do it. Is Fernando on strike? It does need to be limed, right? Yeah, it does. No, senor. I refuse this job. Wait, why do I not need to fucking fertilize? Is fertilizing off? 
I didn't change anything. Is that it? That was the last of it? Yep. Oh, God! Uh, there we go. Oh, cool. It's still not fucking liming. Great. It's just spending our money. Thank you, kind citizen, for driving into my tractor. Yeah, they'll they'll do that a lot. God damn, but geez, you haven't fueled this combine in a while. I usually don't. In fact, I'm pretty sure you're the one who's filling all my machines. I don't think I've ever fueled anything up. <laughs> this is going to be a big fuel bill. That's a lot of diesel. That's what I put into my car every week. Thanks, Trudeau. Oh, that's awkward. I was only going 10 kilometers an hour when I could have been going. Uh, so, Richard, as soon as you've done that, can you uh, swap the plow to a cedar? And make sure it's seeding sunflowers. No, okay. Yes, boss. And start it on that side of the field. And that way they will work into the middle. I really fucking hate liming. Like, if it could make it through the whole field without getting refilled, that'd be... Man, I guess there's no lime tank you can fill from, is there? There's mods, but I don't really want to have a mod. I don't really want to have, like, a tank for everything. No, I, I wouldn't mind having a silo, because then that actually is, like, me doing something. I feel like having a tank for everything is just kind of lazy. If silos can have lime in them, along with, like, food, corn and shit. I don't know if that's a thing. Yeah, that somehow seems like a bad idea. I mean, game logic, who knows? So who wants to fill the lime tank? Ryan's free. <laughs> what do you need to do to do that? You've already done Is that when you're filling the red tank? Oh, well, in that case, I can do that. 
It's his favorite job. I'm almost, almost ready for it. No. Was that right? What did I say? He was asking where you got that. What? Where you ordered that pizza from? The fool. It was actually pretty good. Fine. You should be doing the same, man. You know freezer, right? There. That's officially the last of the wood that was lying around. So what's the goal in terms of money? Goals. 560-ish. I think. It's 460 plus 9. Yeah, it's going to slow down a little at the moment because, yeah, there's no tree income. That's just unacceptable. I mean, once we're done, the... Uh... Once we're done seeding this field, I could just we could just leave it on until the trees are done. Leave it going. I mean, it's up to you. I don't care. I'll just go have like a shower, come back, and it'll be done. <laughs> oh shit! Uh, okay, I'm ready to be reloaded. Just filling some gaps that I left with my remaining line. So, I don't know if this is a bug or whatever. It's like a little patch here that's kind of plowed on an angle. Yes. Is it in the middle, kind of? Uh, no, no. It's like right at the edge. Oh. Hmm. Is that going to be an issue? <laughs> uh, I can try and fix so. it if you want. No, it doesn't matter. As long as it, as long as it is plowed, it doesn't...
No, you're cleaning off my lime, dude. I'm proud of that lime. the heck's going on here? It's a power washer. <laughs> Is that your last line? Yeah, there's literally Pretty like sharp. a small strip on the end here. I'm gonna drive over it. So you want me to load this thing with the cedar, sower, whatever, sunflower seeds? Um, yeah. Well, you don't have to load it. Just pick up a pick up a cedar with that machine, and then make sure that on the bottom right it'll say what it's seeding. Make sure it's sunflowers, and then make Hernando seed the field. Fucking Hernando. Are all these logs done? Yeah, it's all clean over here. Spooky. Yeah, I know. Look at all the space. So much space for activities. Time for some team building exercises. So how do you get more lime? You just go, like, take the tipper wagon and... Yeah, and I just dump it over here. How do I... Can I fold this thing? Uh, yeah. Just follow the... I don't remember the procedure, but you can fold it. Do you want me to go pick up some more line? Uh, sure. I can always use my... Field. Whoops. It's okay. I don't think that thing hurts. It doesn't hurt as long as there's, like, if there's no plant. Okay. And that thing doesn't hurt the plants either. I don't know if the plow does, but that tractor does. Uh, I, there's no, there's no instruction on how to fold this thing. Um. I'm just gonna leave it. It might have to be trying, to, what are you trying to fold? Hold on, let me see. Uh, it might have to be turned the other way or something. What's he trying to fold? The plow. The plow. Yeah, it just had to be turned. That's weird, but okay. There it goes. What does the sower look like? Sower? Yeah. Uh, it's the, the red and the red and yellow thing next to the big black, spooky looking thing over there. Oh, the, the small one. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's on the shopping list. On the wish list is a bigger one. For now, it'll do. Here you go. This truck is too shiny. It feels wrong. It's John Deere colors. <laughs> Gotta get some but mud and dirt shiny. on the thing. It needs to, yeah, it needs to be dirty. You getting pretty full there, or what? Um, no, actually. I just checked. Yeah. It's like 60%. Jesus. Uh, 78%. It does need to be filled too, because it's like it, it, it's pretty much like two loads to do the whole. It's insane how much lime this thing goes through. Okay, so I got some flower seeds. Um... So just go start it, kind of at the other end of the field.
It's pretty much the last of the line. Good thing I'm getting a whole new wagon full. I really want to get a better wagon, but that all happen. Wait, I have to start planting on the white one? The white stuff? No. In real life, yeah. But in this game, no. Okay, it's fine. Well, 97, close enough. Oh, uh, no, don't seed this. Go seed, like, yeah. this has already been seeded. You can tell how, like, nice it is. How, like, neat and tidy the dirt looks. Okay. And it's all plowed and look, shit, it looks so... Well, it looks... So here? Ooh, oh, fuck. Thank no, you. It's like the other end where you, like, finished. Oh, okay. Because this dude, this cedar guy is gonna, is working, uh, from east to west, and this... This Hernando is going to work from west. So, where I finished on that end. Where are you finished plowing at? Like, at the very, very end of the... Yeah. Just ignore the lime. It doesn't need to be... You don't need to seed on lime for some reason. Like, technically, it should have been limed and then plowed. In reality, I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. But this game's retarded, so... Helper E. Yeah, he pulled out in front of me. Totally his fault. You don't have to see it if you don't want to. What? I'm just letting Hernando do oh. it. Oh. I'm just making sure he's, you know, not getting stuck or anything. Such clean lines, man. Shit. It's almost like he's a fucking robot. I can do a pretty clear when I'm seeding. I can do a pretty straight line too. The seeder has uh, marker poles. If you extend a marker pole, it it makes like a little groove. So on your next line, you just follow the groove. Jeez. Pretty, they're pretty nice. I wish everything had them, but it's just the seeders. What the fuck? It looks like you missed a patch. Yeah, there's bugs on this field, and apparently replowing it didn't fix it. I thought it would, but. <laughs> <laughs> There's like little areas that are just non-existent. What is this, Minecraft? We gotta reload those chunks. Oh, that's me. Why does this say helper sees blocked by an object? That's because I, I literally disembarked right in front of him. Is helper C Hernando? Helper C is rich. No, er, yes. They're they're all Hernando. Oh, I see. The oh my god, I got them stuck. <laughs> Never mind. What? There's slime right here. What's, what's this? Is not that line? Well, t -Tex just came in with this. Oh. Okay, I brought it. Delivery. So you guys full up on lime already? Why 
Why do you look so Asian, Richard? Why do you look so Asian? Why do you look so white? Yeah. Is there something wrong with being white? Yeah. So what's going on? We're just waiting for these guys to seed or? Gotta finish seeding and yeah, I guess right now there's no trees to cut, so. Once those trees grow in, we'll be busy. It'll be a busy season. As soon as, as soon as these guys are done seeding, I'm just gonna leave it on 120% until they're grown. It'll take a few days, so it'll be a good time to like... Go away, AFK. Yeah. <laughs> Just don't go AFK in the expensive tractor, okay? Hey, that was an emergency. I, <laughs> I heard so, my. So I was needing our tractor. I heard a, I heard some shouting from downstairs, and then I got to the kitchen. It's just fucking flooding with water. It was Dad swearing at the, uh, the fridge. Oh, that was a lot of swearing. I don't know what he did. Like, I don't know what was going on. I think he just tried to grab some water from the fridge or something. And it just started leaking. I had to, I had to mop it up, basically, while he looked for the shutoff switch. Okay, we're limed. So is there a lot more to do in this game? Yeah, there's multiple, there's like a whole other crops that are completely different than these crops. And there's animals you can raise. We're just uh, limited at the moment by our headers for the combine, which we're hoping to and like, remedy. There's whole other, there's whole other like harvester machines. Ryan, part of the goal for this cheese farm is to grow some cheese. So I've got to get some cows. Cows, yeah, eh? I wouldn't mind doing. I wouldn't mind. Eventually. Oh, you can so get, you get to milk. You gotta, you gotta milk the cows and then what? It's a. <laughs> I don't know if this is actually I cheese. I don't. I don't think you milk the cows, but. I wonder if there's a mod for like so you can get like a. What do you call those things? What they call them in Stardew, yeah. Ryan? I don't know. But I don't even know what you're talking about. The things that turns the milk into cheese. Oh. Um. Fuck, I forgot what they're called. Damn it. Fuck. Oh shit. You talking about fermenters? Maybe. That might be it. Is that what those are? I hate backing up. I really hate backing up. No. Oh, they're just called casks, Richard. Oh, okay. I thought that was a fancy name for them. No. Good enough. Can I help you, sir? No. Why are you holding your chainsaw back? <laughs> like, oh, okay, I see. Wow, look at that. We have an extra fa an extra tractor. I'm, I'm, go so, buy an extra cedar. I'm so proud that everyone's wearing John Deere caps. Oh shit, I forgot to bring shades. Everyone else has shades. What the hell? <laughs> wearing shades at night. I don't know. Yeah, just think about how cool you look. Every Canadian's got given right. Huh, I didn't realize in the uh, the big tractor how good the visibility is, too. 
I'm spending 28 grand, 26 grand for another Are you cedar. Buying? Oh my god. Spending it now as fast as we third, can make it. Now that we have a third tractor, I mean, that's going to increase, that's going to like increase field turnaround by 33%. Wait, I thought we already had three tractors. We yeah, didn't. we don't have three, we don't have three cedar. Uh, oh, you mean because we have the, the, the front loader now? I have a third tractor at my disposal, and having a tractor sitting there when two are going balls out trying to see just kind of. It's only 26 grand. But... What are we going to use for a second loader? Uh. uh take turns? <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. I don't know, dude. We need, like. Look, the trees aren't even grown yet, okay? Let's worry about that when they grow. Maybe we'll buy a, third, a second front end loader. I don't know. Or at least one. Well, yeah. Let's see how good we'll see how good that that uh, scorpion really is. Challenge accepted. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think a scorpion can keep with two. There's no fucking way. Two. Challenge accepted. I'm skeptical about it so I'm being able to keep up with one. Challenge accepted. <laughs> like, you get like, a really good operator in the front end loader? Like, I don't know, you're dead. There's no way. Yeah, dude, you're talking about me and Ryan here. <laughs> True. That's why I specify a really good operator. That's why we need two, man. Two, two fucking junior operators? There you go. And then two trailers. How much is, is that logging trailer? It's probably not a lot. Only like twenty something thousand. Yeah, we could do. We could buy a second or two. If production really ramps that. Don't forget how close things? we are to the sawmill now, though. Uh, yeah, but it might be more efficient to have like easy access for the second loader. What are these, Who knows? What are these white containers near the shed? Oh, that's um herbicide that we decided to not use. Having to spray yet another thing on the field was annoying. Oh, do you have it off right now? Yeah, you don't have to herbicide. Ooh, that's a new one? It's all blue and shit. It's not, it's not John Deere green, man. What is this? Same as the other one. It's just like the cheapy one. Oh, you know what I should do? Before I wreck something, should actually just transfer this one into farming track. Oh, uh, the wheels? <laughs> I don't know where to put this arm. We need it. Can I just sell it? Just put it right huh? here. I guess. With the front loader? Uh, sell the one that has the small fork. Oh, here. This one over here. Yeah, hold on to that one, because the day may come. No! Ryan likes the, these kind of which one? Well, the new front end loader is much different. I know, that's what I'm saying. Right? Ryan likes these small ones. These Which one? one? This one right here, I'm standing on it. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's gonna, he's gonna sell the, the small one over here. This tiny one. Is this now now is a good time to take a break? Oh, that's right. I can't oh, sell right. it here. Fuck, man. Since we're waiting for trees and stuff to grow. Want to go do some sh fucking story? Sure. Just gonna put it over here and forget it exists. <laughs> why, why, 
If you're not gonna sell it, why are you just leaving it way over here? Because I'm never gonna use. It's hide in the bushes. When I get to the where I'm building, like storage facilities, I'll put it in the storage facility. Can I help you, sir? Yes, let me test my let me test my chainsaw on you. You missed the opportunity as a chainsaw. We were, that's how we were cutting up the logs before. Until we got the scorpion. I'm gonna log off for now. Yeah. Okay. I'm not even operating this. I'm just riding along. How is this one only going 10? How badly damaged is the tractor? Oh, the cruise control speed that it's set to affects the AI. Interesting. I didn't know that. Hmm. The tractor's fine. And I know okay. these are I know these are fixed. I fix them every time. Yeah, okay. Now, this is pod race. So they're going faster now? Well, there's three. That's going to be pretty big. Oh, Jesus. So right now, the slowest part is... Um, seating? Seating, yeah. Seating and plowing are the slowest. So if I can reduce the speed of... Or I can reduce the time on plowing or seating, that would be nice. It's a race between John Deere and Big Dick Tractor. John Deere's first off of starting. Oh, shit. Big Dick's got to get catch up. You want to show that right? Okay. Oh. Uh huh? Owned. It's not your fault. So we're a farming simulator. And that's actually pretty fun. I told you. It's not like Harvest Moon, but it's fun in a different way. Like, I, I didn't even know what half this equipment did before today. But it's kind of, it's like, you know, you know what it feels like, Ryan? It's like you're a kid in a sand pit with, like, the little excavator toy thingy. Yeah. yeah.
So out of all the tasks you carried out today, Ryan, which one is your favorite? Probably loading the, lo the lumber. <laughs> what? Is it the most complicated? Complicated. It's a little, a little bit challenging, but I like it. Ryan, people get paid to do this. And I'm doing it for free. It's fucking, like, what is this? You're working for free. It's literally work. Richard. Richard, you found your true calling farming. Oh, no, thank you. I don't like I don't like having to wake up at five in the morning. <laughs> Richard, it's it's farming without having to be all dirty and sweaty. Yeah. Oh, I'm dirty and sweaty, alright. Oh Lord. <laughs> What's it gonna be, Richard? What is it going to be? Hey, did you ask that about that activate window? No. Uh, hold on, I'll ask him. Okay, I'll be back, sorry.